Welcome back to your Feel Good Breakfast Express on SABC3. A beautiful Monday morning. Thank you very much for tuning in. It was a, a very, I think, an exciting time of the year where the White House Correspondents' Dinner yes. happens. It was a big one. I checked Kevin Hart was all up on Instagram in his suit, like, posing in an elevator. <laughs> What's up with people posing in elevators? But anyway, it, it was a very, very exciting time, right? Wow, it was the 100th anniversary. And for those of you who don't know what the White House Correspondents is, it's an organization um, of journalists that cover not only the White House, but the U.S. president as well. Now, this dinner is to provide uh, scholarships. It's a fundraiser to provide scholarships for aspiring journalists and awards recognizing excellence in journalism as well. Now, in previous years, it has been lambasted because it's had too many celebrities, the likes of uh, Kim Kardashian and Lindsay Lohan. Okay, if you, if you invite those two, I can see why, why it's a problem. Why are you judging? Why are you judging? I'm not. They did. <laughs> I'm just going <laughs> I'm at joking, it. I'm joking. I'm um, joking. So this year, they had a few <laughs> others, um, but uh, like Sofia Vergara, Jessica Simpson, Lupita Nyong'o. Hey, right. if you have Lupita there, I'm proud of you. Um, but this year, yeah. when President Obama got onto the stage, he was actually introduced by a little video starring Vice President Joe Biden as well as um, Julia Louis-Dreyfus from Veep. And it's quite entertaining. I think that we need to take a look <laughs> yeah. at how exactly President Obama was introduced. Hey, guys. What are you doing? Nothing. What's in your mouth? Carrots? Hey, don't tell Joe. Haven't you guys listened to anything I've said about healthy eating? Hand it over. Let's hand it over. Yep. You guys, come on, let's move. OK, OK. Busted. Say that again. Oh, this looks good. Mm. Oh, I just forgot my purse, so... I'm sure there are raisins in here. Mm. It's a fruit. Plus, it's more than they give you that correspondence dinner. Let me oh. tell you. <laughs> oh, well, that's so funny. Getting caught by the first wow. lady herself while in you're busy kitchen. eating ice cream. Uh, did you see how she managed to get in the Let's yeah. Move campaign yeah, there? Yeah. yeah. With that as well? But Pretty apparently that's what everyone tries to do when they go to the correspondence dinner. Everyone tries to get into the White House kitchen to see what Jeez. goes down there. Yeah, yeah. And but I guess ice cream is a lot. Yeah. Definitely. But you know what, what I love about uh, President Obama and Michelle is I think that they are the first presidents in history that are so relatable. They are just mm. so down to earth and so funny. Here's a little clip of exactly how much of a comedian President Obama really is. We rolled out healthcare.gov. That could have gone better. <laughs> In 2008, my slogan was, yes, we can. In 2013, my slogan was, control, alt, delete. <laughs> <laughs> ah, no, legendary, legendary. Comedic timing, what, what a legend. He's fantastic. Eh? I mean, he takes jabs at everyone from journalists to lawmakers to celebrities, <laughs> um, even points fun at himself as well, and uh, the health, uh, the healthcare government. So, yeah. yeah. But, but I love the fact that they're so involved, like we say. They are so relatable, actually. And, and yeah, they, they, they're like, like one of you guys, you know, one of us, you know? Exactly. Yeah.